Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do a quick uh, explanation on the Primitive Era tokens. A lot of players are wondering how it works, what it is, and some other stuff like that. So, to access the Primitive Era token, you have to open the pack mall. Once you get in there, you scroll to the right and you got the PE token, okay? So there you have multiple token, okay, for different prices. The first one, uh, my shop is actually in, in euros because I'm in France. Um, but yeah, your prices will be in your currency and with the according prices. Anyway. Uh, as you can see, you can buy multiple types of packs. So it goes from one dollars to a hundred, right here, and you get the according amount of PE token corresponding to the price. So it is written a value valuable in-game currency for pur purchasing packs. Use it, use it in pack mall or benefits. So basically, uh, the PE token is primitive era token is just a conversion of your real life currency, uh, be it dollar, US dollar, euros, uh, whatever currency you're using. It transform it into PE token, and you can then use it to buy packs directly. So let's say I want to buy, I don't know, a custom change pack. I click on it and then I have the option of using right there. There's a pop-up. I It displays the amount of token you have, how much it costs in terms of token. And then you can either pay with real currency or with PE token. So it's a pretty cool feature. It allows the game developers to give their players uh during events like you can the pure tokens i have actually i got most of them from winning events uh on discord facebook or stuff like that and then you can buy packs uh for free or if you bought the pe token with your money but with the pe tokens uh the advantage of pe tokens is that if you buy them once then you can use them whenever you want so Let's say uh, you your currency is pretty volatile, like its value change a lot, then you can plan on buying a PE token when your currency has a pretty high value. And then uh, later on, if your currency drop, well, you will have you will have both the the PE token when the currency was high, which means that the PE token value won't change, but your real currency will have changed. So yeah, it can be a, a good thing to to like buy PE tokens at some key moment for your currency because you will get more tokens uh, in the change. So. There is that, there is also the fact that if you like me, you are lazy, like you hate having to confirm confirm bank transfers or to enter your password or digital uh, fingerprints and stuff like that. When you buy something, then you can just buy uh, a high value PE token once or twice and then whenever you want to pay you just have to click on the pack use PE token it buys the pack and you're done you don't have to confirm anything um, it's also easier to manage your receipt because you will only have one receipt uh, of the PE token of your choice and stuff like that so overall it's a pretty good va uh, pretty good thing I, I really like the feature most people won't necessarily see the interest of it. I give you some some of them, like the key points I find why it is interesting. Uh, if you just want to buy packs, 
you can always buy them just by using grid currency and yeah if, if you don't like the feature just don't use it but in my opinion it's a pretty it's pretty good that they added this just just the fact that they can reward us players uh, from events like that uh, which prevent them from giving us real money so it's overall easier for everyone uh, so yeah I, I think it's cool it allows uh, developers to gift us to to make some gifts to us and stuff like that and yeah so i hope that for those who didn't understand what pe tokens were uh now you are a pro you understand it all and for those who already understood how it was uh, what it was but couldn't figure out exactly what it uh, how it was working or stuff like that well it's pretty simple as you guys could see you just have to click and right now as you can see i don't have enough pe tokens to buy the pack so it re redirect me straight up to my google play so i can make the purchase okay but if the pack is within your pe token uh, value range like that uh, it will show you the possibility to buy real, with real currency or PE token. Uh, anyway, that's about it, about this. And I hope that you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, as always, please help me share uh, my videos, be it on Discord, uh, on, your, on your server in-game or stuff like that. Uh, the more people see it, the more people will we progress in the game and have less questions and stuff like that and the more people will enjoy the game and the more players we have the better the game is because those games are also are all about the social aspect the community and stuff like that and it's really important that all players are happy having fun and yeah so thanks to everyone who is sharing my work and don't forget to hit me up on Discord or in the YouTube comments or whatever. I will always answer. See you guys.